in here, you foul-smelling peasants of Nassau. The British crown has captured yet another dangerous pirate. Captain, dangerous pirate, Captain. Hey, everyone. Thanks for not see little old me. It's great to see all you guys. The flash hey, is here. Oi, don't humor him, you rascalian pirate scum. We're going to end up in jail with him. Hear ye, hear ye, I, Admiral William P. have captured the notorious pirate and leader of this atrocious town of Nassau, Edward Pegleg. Captain Edward Pegleg, my friends call me Eddie Pickle, Mr. Pegleg. Captain! It got better. <laughs> Ow! Ow! We'll spend the rest of his days in these chains. Take a good look, you simpletons. This is what a hardened pirate Looks like a hard and hard with Captain C A B B D E N E Captain. In accordance with King Charles II's royal decree, the pirate town of Nassau has been claimed by the British Empire, and all pirates or resistors shall be imprisoned. Before he goes out to anyone who may support the treacherous crime of piracy. Oh yeah! The British Crown. Wait, wait, wait. I saw you clap me. Maybe some of you guys. Nope. Definitely you two. No, yeah. uh, you know what? Whatever. Come on, Dave. It's off jail, Dave. What? Oh. Yes. Good pirate citizens of Nassau. If you do not want me to go to prison, let me hear you boo. No. If you want me to make a dashing and daring escape, let me hear you cheer. Beautiful. Oh, you, you, oh, oh, oh. you all are so sweet. Oh. Now I don't care what you say, no. Matt. 
do to each other, but I have you so much as chip a piece of paper, my dear boy. I will shove my foot so far up your galley that you won't be able to sit for a week. Well, well, I'm going to tell the king Rogers. And when he learns of it, he will demolish this my disgusting end of yours and, and put a Motel 5 in his place. Did you just call my in disgusting? Well, yeah, he did. Now, Mr. Uh, Tim, White Mr. Yes, Tim, Mr. 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 Tim, Much better, wouldn't you say? 
Mr. Kirk? Much better, sir. Now, what in the name of King Charles II are we going to do about all these pirates? Well, sir, we could politely ask them to surrender their town and pledge allegiance to the British crown. <laughs> Oh, thank you, sir. I know, I know. I'm a silly goose. Uh, I'll be serious. Uh, we need to think of a way to get the pirate captain alone. We're both captains! Captain No Beard runs this town. If we capture him, the others will undoubtedly surrender. We need a distraction. So we're going to get the fire captain alone and then we'll see exactly what I know in this. What do you have in mind, sir? Something that will make a fiery impact. A fiery impact. Like that explosion earlier, that'll distract them. All right, Mr. Kirk, you know exactly what you must do. Go and recreate that same kind of fiery explosion from earlier. And when everyone's attention is on that hot blast, I'll grab Captain Novi. Aye, aye. You can count on me and make one fiery hot stretch. I can use them over here. <laughs> Mr. Kirk, I'll attack on your signal. Whenever you're ready for me to attack, make a sound of a gibbering draft. Got it! Wait! A what? Ah! I could have sworn I heard the Admiral over here somewhere. Charlie, are you sure all of this is worth it? Is all of what worth it? All of this fighting! How could we possibly stand up against the British Empire? Maybe if we surrender, they'll let you keep your ships and let me keep my inn. We can survive. Oh, listen, if we built the Republic of Pirates up from nothing, a place where everyone is equal, where everyone has rights, where freedom reigns, a place where people don't just survive, they thrive. I know it's terrifying to stand up against the British, but if we don't, the citizens of Nassau will lose everything that the Republic stands for. Some things are worth fighting for, Elizabeth, and freedom is one of them. What else is worth fighting for, Charlie? A girl worth fighting for. And Elizabeth? Yes, Charlie? That is a girl worth fighting for. What? Hello, Captain Nobeard, how are you? Ah, hey. Why didn't you tell me you hired a hot new strumpet? I Hello. Didn't. Charlie, I don't think that's one of my girls. How could you hide that booty from me? Get your head out. I'm sorry things didn't work out between us, but honestly, you have got to move on. Excuse me? This is just sad, and honestly, I'm embarrassed for you. How dense are you? That is clearly the absolute... Elizabeth. Hi. Hey. Charlie, How I don't you get in your way anymore. You have honor. <laughs> Hello, my gorgeous broad-shouldered goddess. I've never heard the notorious Captain Nobeard. Oh, the notorious Captain Nobeard. So dreamy. I know. I've always wondered. Why do they call you that? Yeah. Blackbeard, Bluebeard, there's countless beards sailing the sea. So I made the brave and daring fashion choice to go beardless. Uh, no, 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 it's actually because he's physically incapable of growing body hair. What is it? You'll have to excuse my ex. Oh. She's still not over me. What did you just say? Toodles. Bye, Charlie. I'm out of here. Have fun with that. I'm sorry you had to see that. My love, my what beautiful and hairy arms you have. Ooh, what a voluptuous and bold beard you have. Oh, God. Bless you. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Oh, I dreamed of kissing you since the moment my eyes laid eye on you. Ah! Mr. Kirk? Your hairless body secret is safe with me. Oh! oh. There'll be no living with her after this. She's just gonna bring it up and... <laughs> oh, sweet mercy. What took you so long? Well, I was waiting on the fiery hot oh. distraction. Do you not see my finger in the stress? I am the fiery hot distraction. You know what, Charlie? Actually, I... Oops. For the love of Satan, no. put my idiot ex-boyfriend down. Yes, please. Quickly, Mr. Kirk, get him out of here. Gather as many citizens as you can, and I'll eat with you after I dispatch of this witch. Yes, sir. <laughs> Seriously? Really? What? Did you think you captured him and we just oh, surrendered? You can't see me. You're killing <laughs> a pirate. Shut up, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
Let's have a huge round of applause for your Six Flags America stunt team! 